Hi, we are at the Home Depot on Highway 27, looking for some plants, some more soil for our garden. Guys, look at these succulents. Look how big these ones are. Wow. And these. Look, even the cactus. A lot of succulents too. And look, now we're at the lemon, there's lime. I don't see any fruits on them. And look, the peaches. What's this one? This one has stuff on it. This is a citrus fruit. Yeah, the orange. Right, more orange tree. A lime, Mexican lime. And look, this one right there. And look. Seven gallon clean palm. Only 40 bucks. Used to be 60. Look how big this street is, guys. And then we got tangerine. More lime. This is a plum tree. And then, look at this. This is dragon fruit, guys. Uh-uh. I am going to get one of this one. My yard is very big. I'm going to sit and try this. I'm going to try it. No, look at that price tag. See, Dad said he wanted this one, but then this one he said is nice too. Okay, guys, we're at the end of our plants. And look, they have the vine plants. They have more stuff attached to it. And look, a little baby palm. And this is indoors too, so yeah. What is it? Yeah, house plant. Indoors. And guys, look at how much seed package they have. A lot of seed packets. Guys, now we're at the lights and look at this. I wonder how they fold the light. How do they do that? And look how much lights they have. And here's ceiling fan. 
So be careful where you dig now. You're not. You're liable to snatch your egg and pull you right in. Yeah, I tried this green one. Uh -uh. Guys, look at the pineapple. And look. This is the vine plant. Look how big this leaf is. I think I have one of these already. And these are the monsteras. Look at this pepper. Okay guys, we got our soil, and I got me some snacks, I got chips and a water, and we got all the stuff to put in the backyard. Okay guys, we are taking all the soil out the car, and we're gonna go to the back. Okay, th this tree, we're gonna take out this tree, and then plant in the next tree over here. The soil is to put in the floor, because this tree is like a male tree, it's not the area. We've been over here for two years and that's how all is good. So we're going to replace this tree with a different one. This is the tree we're going to replace the tree with. This is called a Kaimit tree. Trinidadian name Kaimit. So this is an plant. This is a tangerine tree, a grafted tangerine. So we're going to plant this somewhere in the yard. We got to look for some space. It's very nice, nice and sweet fruit. Okay, this is our cherry tree. We have we have it here for two years, and we we now start getting cherries in it. Still green, but it's looking very healthy. Coming up, very nice. A lot of flowers in the trees. Just hoping that we get some more cherries. I've seen there's a lot of cherries here. See, like one is here. And then this is our sugar cane, two years again planted. Sweet, nice sugar cane soap. Our plum tree got from the neighbor, start growing. And this is our little backyard over here that we try to plant all the fruit trees. This is our sour cherry tree, Trinidad sour cherry. And I think is they call it gooseberries. Our um, our side entry, China, they call it um, meringue, meringue. Some snails here, we gotta take them out. And this one is our fig tree, our first time we pay been for two years now. Got a lot of fruits in it. A lot, a lot of fruits. 
open very nice very nice fruits and I hope you guys know about this tree here this is the Downs tree it was very very small it was just like a little branch here and just within the two years it's all the way big like a very very tall tree haven't been, been anything as yet open soon maybe next year Our banana tree here. They try to have a little everything in the yard, you know. They got a big, very big yard. There's a guava. There's our avocado tree here. Growing very healthy and nice. Hope all is grafted. Hope they be bearing soon. And this is our. Um, I have no idea what tree is this. This. Um, this is some kind of sugar apple, sugar apple tree. Sugar apple. Next cherry tree over here. Been a year and a half in this tree. We get some we get a couple cherries from this. Not much, but oh there's a ripe one over here. Hope, hope you guys can see. Very, very sweet. Okay, this is mine. No nobody are getting this one. This is mine. It's first bearing. Okay. And don't forget to get our Cassava, this is our cassava tree. Just have a couple months, it's all the way big like this. So we get our mangoes, guavas, we get a little crows here. Mango. Oh, this is the same tree, our same tree over here. Get a lot of flowers in the trees. And we, oh, we get two same over here. Wow. That's amazing. There's two for now. A lot of flowers more coming up. This is our orange tree here. Right, for lime tree, you see lime, a lot of lemon on the, lime on the tree here. It's a lot of lime on the tree. My kids and I went to the supermarket yesterday and they bought lime. And they don't even come in the backyard, there's so much lime in the tree here. Oh, this is our um, golden apple, loaded, and more flowers. This is a bunch of over here, very big. Come along. Nice. Okay, let's walk around again and keep looking. This is um, some kind of jamun tree, they call it. Oh, and this is my um, five fingers. I think you guys call it star fruit. Oh my God. See, it's all the way to the root. And very, very sweet. I just had one yesterday. Very sweet. A uh, lot of flowers again on the trees. All is grafted, so you know, it's gonna be very small tree. And I tried planting some okra. Very beautiful okra. Come on, nice. Oh, pigeon peas trees. Um, you see some trees that we recently planted. Just maybe about a week or two. We have a, a guinea tree, chenet, they call it. Um, I don't know which one is this. This is uh, sour sap. Oh, this is a sour sap. This is our sour sap. This mango tree is a Julie mango. I guess you Trinidadian people know Julie mango. We just bought it, look, it's start. More branches is coming on. Maybe next year, some mangoes, because the guy says it's gonna be mangoes very soon. That's our tree. Okay. Family, this is our cat. He loved the backyard also too. When we out here, he's out here. He loved the grass. You hear him? You see him? Oh yeah, he loved the the yard. Okay, so let's go back to the. This is our papaya tree. Papaya tree start bearing now flowers. We only get them like a couple, about six or seven months now. Not so bad. And this is our watermelon. 
it happened to grow here in the floor so we just left it so we get a couple of watermelon here this one over here this two here and there's the next one over here tree and this is our cashew tree the one with the nut outside we only have them like about one year now this is um oh you know the sapodilla oh here the cat over here you know he loved the he loved the trees okay 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 we know this is your tree this is the sapodilla we just only have them like about nine months now it's coming up nice it's about three feet high okay mr cat and he loved the backyard he all over the trees this is our banana tree over here. Our long and tree. Beer is the long and beer ready, but not that much. It was very, very sweet. See, he's all over the place. All over the place. Is that. This is our next cherry tree. A lot of cherries, flowers. You can see the cherries over here. Ready. They want one cherry is here. There's another one here. There's a lot of cherries in here. But the, the leaves are green and so the fruits are green so you don't get to see them. Let's see if I see some more again. I got a lot but I can't find it. Everything is so green. Yeah, there's the next one right here. Screen. See, he's all over the place, he's all over the yard. We love the yard. When the sun goes down, the backyard is shade, so we love the shade. Okay, Mr. Cat. This is our coconut tree. Oh. And you know what is this, guys? This is our sorrel. This is only about five months now. I know we're gonna get sorrel for Christmas. This is some kind of tree, I have no is this kind of tree, I don't know if you guys know the name or what's the fruit, you can leave a comment. I can't remember exactly what's the name of this right now. And th this is our peach tree. We just, a couple months ago we bought it from the flea market. So it's okay. And that's about it in our, our backyard. This is a whole backyard. This is our next uh, tree over here we have. The Dong tree. Then we have the Poi Baji. So this is everything here. Let me show you the next golden apple. Oh, Palm City. I'm going towards it. It's loaded. Lots of little flowers. Lots of little ones. It's all inside half. There's more coming up here. Oh, a banana tree here. And we can't wait for this plum tree to be here. When we had the hurricane, it's all dried down. It wasn't this, I thought it was all dead. All of a sudden, it sad grows up, and here it is how big it is. Hope it's sad bearing. Oh, here the cat, he's walking as we come in. See, you like the backyard? He's going to be here in a while. Taking the exercise. You love the evening walk, you know? That's, that's how it is. We get a little walk in the backyard to do. Clean up. Burn some boxes. Pack up our shed. Because a couple of days we had some rain, so we couldn't do anything in the back. And this is our little peppers, okra, flowers, you know. Little this and that on the place. A lot of poi, poi baji. Oh, here the cat. See, he likes snoop around. Okay. 
is all about all the like green peas, pigeon peas. This, this is um, passion fruit. Oh, we had a lot of passion fruit this year. Now we have like about 30 or 40 passion fruit in this little tree. But now is season is done for it. Our, our um, sweet peppers coming up really nice. You keep yourself busy in the backyard, you know, with this. And this is our grapes. Oh, very, very sweet grapes. Very sweet grapes. Very sweet grapes. Let me get all those trees over here. See, we have a whole set of things we need to fix up. But, you know, it was raining a couple of days, so we didn't get a time, you know. Seasonal. Some more green peas, pigeon peas. Like and that's about it. This is our yard. Yeah, yeah, a little messy, but you know, sorry about that. But next time on the video, you're going to see everything clean, put away. It's just because of the, the little rain that we have for been falling for the whole week. Oh here yeah, the cat is following us everywhere we go. He's the boss of the house. So he's checking maybe he's checking the work that we do. Making sure everything is good for him. And this is a pool which nobody don't go inside. Nobody don't swim in this pool. And this is the next door. What you doing? He only likes sleep. He just wake up. He loves the yard and all too. Okay, so you guys take care. We'll see you in the next video. Hope we clean up this place and show. make it look very nice. I don't know what's the next trip, but maybe soon some new video is going to be out. So please like, share and subscribe for this video the Rampasad family and all the youtubers over here in Perth so take care for now bye